What's going on guys? Today we're going to be talking about the leaked Canon R1. Last week we had a leaked image of the Canon R1. Now we have some rumors, so let's jump into it. The Canon R1 will have a 45 megapixel sensor with some people saying it's going to be an 80 megapixel sensor. So which one of these is true? Who knows? It might be an 80 megapixel sensor with the ability to just shoot 45 megapixel images as well. It's going to have the biggest LCD currently on the market. Some people are saying it's going to come in at four inches. The EVF is going to be extremely high resolution as well as an extremely high refresh rate, no blackout. You're going to have dual CF Express cards. The rumor is they're going to be CF Express C cards which those are still in beta and they're not out yet so i'm thinking it's going to be more of the cf express type b cards so you know if you already have cf express type b cards you could just swap them out into the new camera but if they're cf express c cards these cards are absolutely massive the size is going to be the traditional 1d series style camera it's going to have the vertical grip but Canon's doing a lot of time trying to cut that weight down so it's not a huge, massive, heavy camera. So they're doing a lot of weight savings. You're also going to have the top-down display like on the R5, but with this variant, it's going to be color. You're also going to be able to customize that to your liking. I'm curious to see how that's going to work and what content are you able to show on top of the camera. It's also rumored to have a whole new autofocus system, whether that be the quad pixel autofocus or another video variant. Maybe they're just going to go with the dual pixel, but I'm thinking they're going to go with the quad pixel AF. I'm curious to see how that's going to work and how well it does work. I'm also curious to see if it's going to have the same autofocus system, kind of like the R3, where it tracks your eye and where you're looking inside the EVF, and it'll focus on that if they do include that in the camera. On the video side of things, there's no real rumors out yet, but I will assume that you will have the ability to shoot 8K RAW. I I would say 24, 60, possibly even up to 120, which would be nice, as well as the 4K is going to be over sampled 8K. I'm definitely curious to see what video features they're going to jam into this camera, whether there's going to be overheating or anything like that. The release is sometime before the Paris Olympics with the announcement hopefully around January 2024. That's kind of the time frame that they're going for sometime around the new year. They also said that the R5 Mark II will be announced before that, and we're hoping to see that by the end of the year. That's all I have for this quick little rumors video. If you did like this, and if you're looking forward to more rumors, definitely subscribe, leave me a comment down below, and until the next video, peace.